Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to Ask NK. Twin Motion 2020 is now official and available. Actually, this new release is called Twin Motion 2020.1, which has to do with a couple of updates that will be coming to this. So we're probably going to be getting like 0 0.2, 0 0.3, 0 0.4, you know, within the duration that we're having Twin Motion 2020. And if you want to get this, you can go over to your Epic Launcher and simply download this right now. If you haven't downloaded the previous version, we do have news for you. So all you have to do is just sit back and wait because there is a whole lot of things that you need to understand about this one before you proceed to downloading this version. So moving on to the new features that is coming for Twinmotion. Twinmotion 2020 is coming with a whole set of features and we're starting out with the enhanced lighting and rendering effect that has been improved and also reworked with this new release. But before we get started with the enhanced lighting and rendering, let's simply talk about the logo the logo is some sort of statement so last year epic games actually bought twin motion from advent but it's really cool to see that the guys at epic games have taken this a step forward by changing the logo which has to do with a huge statement about the revolution and also you know the dynamism that is coming to twin motion and this is really really cool as i am actually in love with the entire thing and looking at it you can actually tell that there is a huge dynamism that will be coming over to the tool following a couple of updates that has been coming and at the same time we've been seeing a huge feature coming over to this tool over a period of time within the time that this tool has been purchased from the guys at advent so with that said let's proceed with the enhanced lighting and rendering so for the enhanced lighting and rendering there is out of the box global illumination so there is now a brand new screen space global illumination for indirect lighting and at the same time it's going to get you some very cool stuff trying to match physical light following this there is also for exterior scenes you'll be able to get atmospheric sun and sky that will be offering realistic skies at the same time you will also be playing with accurate reflections with different locations season time and also weather and all of these things are there to include a beautiful sunset so just in case you want to play with lighting using interior or exterior twin motion have you covered now this isn't the only thing that is coming to the advanced or the enhanced lighting and rendering some other cool stuff that will be coming consists of the brand new area light that also comes in with volumetric and lighting so the previous time we did talk about how you can create volumetrics using the previous twin motion which was twin motion 2019 and there was just a little trick around it that we kind of created but then this was more like a gimmick compared to what we have now what we have now is proper volumetric light and this was one of those things that I got to you know talk to the guys at Epic Games and it's really cool to see that they listened and they actually went ahead to implement something like this and still speaking about the cool things that you can get there is now a brand new depth of field feature that is now here most probably like an advanced one or an improved one the depth of field that is now available would go through and mimic real life camera to give you some very cool cinematic effect and how cool or how sick is that so right now you'll be able to combine both your lights and your camera together to get something way cleaner than you probably would get in previous versions of twin motion we also have a brand new feature that has to do with x materials so in case you're doing things like venting plumbing you know glasses we already talked about a couple of these things earlier they are now available right here the enhanced vegetation system is also something brand new as they are now working with a set of high resolution assets from xfrog and at the same time there is a whole new way that you get to work with this so contrary to the way we used to work with these things before now you can choose to work with your object based on a given order depending on the magnitude also depending on the age and also the season so you now have way more varieties on how you can play with these things and manipulate them and these vegetation systems still maintain the same dynamic nature of the previous version of twin motion that has to do with the weather and i'm very excited about the whole grass system that is coming in there is also some vegetation assets that would be coming from mega scan that is also teased previously and it's really cool to see that these things actually made it to the final version of twin motion so we already know that epic games but you know Pixel Mega Scan previously, and the assets are now totally out there for anyone that is making use of Epic Games, you know, tools to use. And it's really cool to see that they have a huge integration of the Mega Scan stuff directly 
into twin motion so it's going to give us way more photorealistic stuff to work with especially when we're trying to get things going and still looking at things that are way more realistic the guys from anima xyz are integrating their 3d human character with twin motion so i think the guys at epic games decided to go all out to play with the big boys this time you know getting some very high quality stuff into twin motion as a visualization tool and right now we have about 62 motion capture animated characters that you can work with we also do have about 82 ready posed characters that you can use for totally anything that you want so all of these characters are being sourced by the guys at anima xyz and you can see how much details or how much photorealistic nature these things actually hold up to so i can already start seeing that there is going to be a whole lot used for this it's also really cool to note that with all of these things going on possibly we're going to start getting a huge integration with third-party softwares like you know cinema 4d maya and also blender i guess these things are also set for the future but right now still speaking about things you can do integration with we already know that there is a one-click synchronization feature with sketchup and also revit and it's really cool to note that we now have that for Rhino and also for Akikad. So this is just, you know, totally, totally insane that you can work with all of the tools that you are native to and you can synchronize all of these things directly back into Twinmotion. And one that is way more exciting for me is the fact that you can use Grasshopper and Rhino hand in hand and you can transfer those data from Rhino over to Twinmotion and you can get those things directly there. So these are very cool stuff that we are seeing and there is just way more stuff you may want to see so if you want to see most of the stuff that is now available for twin motion link is going to be in the description so that you can go through and check them there is an auto exposure that is also available right now we're definitely going to do a full walkthrough about some of these tools so don't worry about them well there is also a brand new set of area lights that is coming and at the same time yes so at the same time there was a complaint earlier about the you know emissive lights and the emissive stuff and it's really cool that they paid attention to that and right now we have some brand new emissive shaders that you can simply throw into your scene and get those very lovely emissive shaders working there is also a brand new section where you can now use custom decals and i know that there was a lot of questions about this so right now that shouldn't be much of a problem there is also a video which we covered that has to do with a very neat trick on how you can work with videos and shout out to the guys at twin motion right now they've gone ahead to fix that as we now have a native video importing stuff now in twin motion so right now you can just simply throw in video material instead of using the tip and trick that we talked about the last time you can now do this thing legally in twin motion and it is just so so cool and still speaking about some cool stuff that you can do in twin motion because i'm really excited about this one is the notes object so you can now literally pin notes to your boards you know pin notes to your model and you can get this thing out of your way and send it back just in case you want to give feedback you want to review certain things this is definitely going to make a whole lot of things easier there is also a full touch screen support so in case you're exporting your stuff from twin motion over to an ipad or over to you know an android device there is now a full touch screen support so your clients can easily navigate around your model and you know investigate this model look around the model and get some things going for them for the improvements there's a lot of improvements so i'm just going to leave these ones for you guys to come check them out there's a whole lot of improvements from the glow material like we talked about earlier to the improvements for the media dock and at the same time there is a grass customization improvement vegetation painting also has some very lovely improvement there is also a huge huge improvement for the cutout yeah for the cutout people there's a huge improvement for that and there's also an improvement and a brand new feature coming to the grass that has to do with fading of distances so these are just very nifty cool lovely stuff that the guys at epic games have gone ahead to create and they have they have actually outdone themselves with these brand new features that they've pushed out and i cannot just wait to get it and if you want to get it one more time you would need to get the epic launcher and this is one of the things that the guys at epic games actually talked about earlier that if you want to get this tool when it's out you need to have subscribed previously to get this tool when it was free for the epic version right now if you want to get this and let's say you don't have 
any of the accounts you're just trying to get this for the first time so just in case you're just about getting into twin motion and you want to get these tools right now you may have to pay this particular amount which is going to be about 250 for a perpetual license that will be valid all the way to the end of december 2021 and this isn't a subscription assistance but then if you're not able to get this you just want to try to emotion first before you make the decision to purchase there is a free version right here so all you have to do is download the epic launcher get the free version try the whole thing see how it works if you like it then you can proceed to purchase at the same time if you're working in a university probably your student your teacher and you want to get this there is also a free trial option for those that are wishing to evaluate these new features and also a free educational version for students and teachers and i think the guys at epic games are very generous for a lot of things that they've created and a lot of things that they've made open for so many people to play with and i cannot just wait to have my hands directly on this tool and start playing with them and sharing a whole lot of tips and tricks with you guys i would like to know what you guys think about this in the comment section which of these new features are you most excited about tell me what your thoughts are in the comment section and of course if you like this video you know what to do go ahead and give it a like and don't forget to share with a friend and if you're new here it's going to be amazing if you can hit the subscribe button and also turn on notifications so that you don't miss the next video or the next update and until i see you guys again with a tutorial update free friday tutorial tuesday tips and tricks things like this peace